everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome to my channel. If you're new, I hope you enjoy the video and you decide to subscribe. And if you're a current subscriber, welcome back and thank you so much. So today I'm going to be planning in my catch-all planner for the week. Um, it is the dashboard layout. Let me go ahead and pull these out. For those of you that aren't familiar with Happy Planner, it is a disc-bound system. The main reason why I love it so much is because you can remove the pages. It makes it so easy. It's easier to write in the center of the page if you need to, or just whatever you need it to be. Okay, so I went ahead and put some washi tape down because I did pre-plan this, and I'm glad that I did because I struggled with it. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> this was not the easiest layout to do, but... I, think maybe I have it under control. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> but anyway, I used um, I used this, and I believe this was from Recollections a long time ago. I think I actually got it on clearance at Michael's. So I don't know if you can find it, but it goes perfect with the stickers that I'm going to use. And this is out of the Color Story 460. I don't know what number it is because, yeah, I've lost track. But, um, and this section is their, the Free Spirit. Um, I don't have the Free Spirit book, so I was really glad that these were in here so I could kind of have a sampling of it. As you can see, I've already pulled a bunch of stickers, but let's just go ahead and jump in and get started. Because like I said, I did pre-plan, so I have most of what I'm going to use already pulled out onto wax paper. And if you're not familiar, I use wax paper to pre-plan because you can lay it over the page and see where you're putting stuff. Okay, so I'm going to put this one here. This was actually, this came from the um, Free Spirit journaling stickers. So I've been wanting to use those too, so let me get it. I don't want to. doesn't go all the way to the edge on that side, but that's okay. But anyway, I could make some little notes or something in there. Okay. Oh, which ones do I want to do next? Okay, this one. Like I said, y'all, I struggled with this one. I don't know why. These stickers are so pretty. They should just, you know, jump off the page and put themselves down, but they don't. <laughs> bit of layering. It's a little crooked, but I'm okay with that. So if everybody is having a good weekend, and I'm going to cover the today up. This isn't really going to be for a specific day. It will just be one of my mini lists ahead and put the month. This October came from, oh, I'll show you. It's the old date and holidays book. This one right here. I'm trying to use these up, guys. <laughs> They're, that book is getting really empty. I'm almost to the point where I'm going to pull it apart. And this is a quote sticker that a good friend of mine, Mickey, sent to me. And I don't know what shop it came from. It came from an Etsy shop, but I'm not sure which one. But it says, I don't want ordinary. It's not in my nature. And that kind of, that's kind of me. So, all right. I want to cover up these lines. I'm not going to use this section for anything specific. I'm just going to use it to make it pretty. Cover that stuff up. Actually, I want to cover up this too because that's going to show through if I don't. Okay. And I've got the long list sticker here. And I'm just going to, well, it'll quit curling on me. I'm going to line it up at the bottom. Actually, no, I'm not because I want it to come up here. little label on it. And 
And I guess to kind of explain a little bit about how I plan my process, I'm a before the pen planner. I don't have a lot of things that happen on specific dates. Most of my stuff is just to-do lists because I don't have a lot of appointments or anything like that. I don't have children um, at home, so I don't have, I have a stepson, but he's grown, so I don't have, um, you know, I don't have to write down like soccer games and stuff like that. So, um, my planner is really just a lot of to-do lists and on this page I can kind of break down like I do fill in this like when I'm thinking about stuff that I need to to put on the grocery list I'll just write it in there and then transfer it to my my um, happy Nietzsche when I get to ready to go grocery shopping I go pull the list off the refrigerator and I pull the list <laughs> off of out of here and then um, put it all in my happy Nietzsche and go to town. Let's see. This was where I was struggling was with this stuff. So I want to use this. It says Wild Heart with a Gypsy Soul. That's okay. And then I have these. Um, I like these little constellation stickers I thought were really pretty, just to kind of add a little something. I don't know what constellations these are, by the way. I wish I did. And then I also, I used this little star punch because I wanted some more stars. I couldn't find like a color paper that I wanted. I was trying to hurry. So what I did was I punched them out. Let me find them. I did. I punched it out of this little sticker right here. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> so I'm going to see how this works. I don't know how it's going to look because some of them, like I accidentally punched on a, I don't know. I did it weird. So some of the stars are kind of, off looking but I'm gonna put them on the edge so it just kind of looks like they're supposed to be that way well I need my tweezers and my nail chipped just before I started filming this so I hadn't decided if I'm just gonna fix it because all the rest of them are good still or if I'm gonna change my polish tomorrow Let's see Perfect. there that's good I have another one that was the same way. I had a heck of a time getting the backing off of these. Let's see, where do I want to put it? Maybe over here. No, I want to put it right there. That's not too bad. And I did two more and I was like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> that was fun. Hmm. something right there. Should have got something better to cover up that washi, but put it over here, over here. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it over here. Okay. Uh, I don't know how I like that, but I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put another little place to write some like a little to-do list or something. I forgot to turn the TV down. And then this one I wanted to put right here. Okay. Now on the other side, I'm going to put the dates down first because I usually don't do that. I can see where my. What did I do with my tweezers? Oh, right there. Okay, and these also came, the date stickers also came from this one. And I'm going to put them on the outside bottom corners. 
Christmas week. Oh, Halloween is next week, I think, isn't it? Or is it? Yeah, is it next week? Get to do a Halloween spread. And if y'all haven't seen it yet, I started the giveaway. The video was posted for that yesterday. Um, the drawing will be, um, it's open until Saturday the 26th. But, and I'll probably do the drawing on the 27th. So if you're watching this before October 27th, go look down in the description and there will be a link to the giveaway video. And all you have to do is make sure that you're subscribed to my channel and answer the questions in the video. It's simple, easy peasy. And at first I wasn't going to do international, but you know what? I just, it's YouTube and YouTube is international and you know, I know I have viewers that are from out of the country, so, you know, I just, I changed my mind, and I put it in the description of the video, so if you're international, go ahead and sign up, go ahead and enter, and, um, you know, if I have to ship internationally, I will just figure it out. <laughs> it can't be that hard. Okay, and hopefully it's not too expensive. All right, now I gotta remember where I was gonna put the rest of this stuff. This is a little weekend sticker. It says, hello weekend, nice to see you again. Oh, it's hot in here. I'll be so glad when this weather decides what it wants to do. Right here, I usually make a list of things that I need to photograph or film. Just kind of have it right there in front of my face. Right, and Sunday, we have a new moon. I can usually put quite a few stickers on the weekends because I don't, especially on Sunday. Sunday is football day, so I don't do a whole lot of marking the list off, <laughs> marking things off the list. I'm going to make sure I didn't get it off the side there. I'm going to cut this one. Hmm. Do I want to put it right there? Let's get the, my other box stickers down real quick. I'm just going to put a box here. And I think this box was actually meant for the monthly view. That's why it has that little notch. I'm just going to put a little heart there. I just think that looks better than having that notch there. Let's see, Monday. Well, that fit perfect. And then I need to put this one down here. It says these are the days. can get it straight. Okay, that's straight enough. And then here, make today great. Now the Friday. Let's see, do we want to put it there? I think maybe right there at the top. I'm gonna put it in the middle. 
है Okay, now that's all the stickers that I pulled. So, is there anything that we want to add? Let's look through the sticker book real quick and see. Well, this one went kind of quick. I'm getting better. So, I think next month for my catch-all, I'm going to do all, like, bullet journal stuff. I'm a little nervous about it because... You know, but I've been having, I've just, you know, been thinking of all kinds of great ideas and stuff that I can, stuff I can do. So, I'm going to try it out, see how it goes. And that may be one of my um, more permanent ways that I plan next year. I'm still have not, I've only got one 2020 planner so far. And that's going to, it's my vintage botanical that I use for household. And I haven't, um, I just haven't decided which other ones I want. Let's see. You know, I'm going to put, no. No, less is more, Nicole, less is more. Let's see. I love this one. That's so pretty, but I don't really have a place to put it. And these were the clear stickers that came with it. I used like all the stars, but I already have free spirit there, so I don't want to use that one. These I'm gonna save because I don't they don't really go and the arrows don't either. So I think that is it. I think we're just gonna leave it like this. Just get my little wish.com corner rounder. Now this dashboard layout is not out of any specific planner. It's from the um, the extension pack. I just I love the functionality of the dashboard layout, and a lot of my bullet journal spreads will probably be similar to this. But I just kind of wanted to do a little bit more like decorating, and it'll be a lot easier to do if I have a blank page. So I think that's it. That's it. I'm really, I think I am happy with how this turned out. It wasn't the train wreck that I thought it was going to be. <laughs> so, okay. So coming up next video that will be out will be happy Nietzsche for next week. We'll get that planned. And then also don't forget to look for the giveaway video and go and enter that. Cause I'm all of the things that I showed in the video, those will all be going to the winner. Now, I'm also working on doing a D stash this week. So I'm going to be throwing in some other stuff and surprise stuff and most of the surprise stuff will probably be happy planner stuff so make sure you go sign up so you can get in on that and I may even buy some more stuff to go in it and if I do like I might sit down and look at it and I might have like a first and second prize but the first prize will be getting everything that's shown in the video so go take a look at that follow the directions and get entered and if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below or DM me if you want to keep it private. I love hearing from all of you, and I try to respond within 24 hours. You can also find me on Instagram and Pinterest. The link is below in the description or on my channel page. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell if you want to receive notifications so you don't miss any new videos. That's all I have for right now. I really hope that you enjoyed the video, and thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.